Hey there, Jed Barker with Best Life Mortgage. I make these videos to help educate you on the home loan process so you can make better financial decisions when buying a home and using financing. Today, I'm going to look at a newer listing by a really awesome friend and uh, real estate partner of mine, Beth Herbster, here in the upstate of Greenville, South Carolina. Um, I'm going to show you one of her listings, and then I want to answer the question, what level of income or how much do I need to make in order to qualify for a loan on this property? I want to answer that question because I do get that quite a bit. Maybe one of the most frequent questions is, you know, what do I qualify for? So let's look at a particular house and then look at, and then what we'll do is we'll look at what you need to earn in income to qualify for that property. So let's go ahead and get into it. First off, let's take a look at this home here. I'm going to go ahead and reduce the size of this little window. Get me out of the way. This is a great, uh, awesome new listing. It's for sale. It's uh, listed at $380,000. It's a beautiful home that's really been renovated really, really well. It's in Greenville, South Carolina. Um, I'm going to just scroll down a little bit. If you take a look at the property itself here, uh, the wonderful pictures of the hardwood floors, um, renovated kitchen, just really a nice, nice little home here for sale in Greenville, South Carolina. It's listed by Beth Herbster. I saw Beth on her Facebook page the other day, uh, do a little bit of a walkthrough. So let me just turn that on for a minute here. I uh, will take a look at that. She's going to walk into the home here and do a little walkthrough on it. But if you take a look as we're walking through here, it's got a nice, you know, front room here with the dining table, kitchen table area. Looks like an awesome fireplace. Um, as you walk through there, um, you know, floors, uh, creative kitchen or uh, bathroom floor there. Looks pretty nice. Let me skip ahead a little bit. I really like these floors in here, how they're done. And as well as the kitchen, it's got the, the nice countertops all the way around. So all in all, it looks like a really beautiful place, um, a great find. And um, it's listed by Beth Herbster of Keller Williams. She's a, a real estate partner of mine. I've known her for a few years now at least, and she's always been awesome to work with, takes very good care of her clients, uh, very communicates very well. Um, really, I can't say anything but awesome raves about Beth Herbster and what she's been doing out there in, in this area for her clients. Now, let's go ahead and take a look at the question. What do I need to earn in order to qualify to buy this home? So it's a little bit of a, a question that has a lot of, you know, somewhat complexities. Um, so I'm gonna have to break it down to maybe some of the easiest, uh, easiest answers. Um, and so what we're going to do is we're going to do this. If, a, if you're making $75,000 a year in earned income, and you're buying this house at a current rate of 6.5%, and you're using an FHA loan at 3.5% down. So that's what we'll look at today is the FHA financing portion of this. Could be other loan pipes with higher down payments, obviously, and stuff like that. But we'll look at the FHA loan. And let's say you're putting 13300 down, and the property taxes come out to $2,800 a year, and you pick up homeowner's insurance on this for $1,200 a month. If these things, uh, oh, one other category, uh, mortgage insurance. So if your mortgage insurance is, uh, FHA mortgage insurance right now is at 0.55%. So it went down from 0.75 or 0.8. I think it was 0.75 or it could have been 0.8, but it went down to 0.55 now. So if you're earning 75K a year with no other debt obligations, I mean, you don't have a car loan, you don't have any more student loans, you've done just a really great job on your on your actual you know obligations, your debt obligations, you don't owe any money, so you're debt free except picking up this house. Then if we scroll down, we're going to see you will qualify, um, I believe, you know, based on just the debt to income ratios, um, quite easily actually for this home at 383,161. Now that home's listed at 380, but you'd qualify for 383. And that's only on a 46% debt to income ratio. If you have a, a higher credit score, um, you may be able to go a bit higher than that as well. Um, we don't want to put it too high though, because this would need to be the front and the back end ratio. So we don't want to put it too much higher, but all that being said, 75K will allow you to qualify for that property um, for a home loan. Um, and your monthly payment, if we keep scrolling down, you break down your mortgage payment breakdown, your mortgage payment would be 2841. That would be 2338 for mortgage uh, for principal and interest. It would be 233 for taxes, 100 for mortgage insurance, or 100 for homeowner's insurance, and 170 for mortgage insurance. So a total of 2841. Uh, if you want to look at your particular situation, uh, I'd be happy to do that for you and with you. Um, please contact me. It's 800, it's 864-800-9251. You can contact me here on social media, message me, Facebook, you know, Instagram, everything like that. Um, your situation is going to be different than this. If you have, if you had to have monthly debts or your credit's lower, 
um, or anything like that, right? And so we could look at yours, particularly what you would qualify for and go from there. But if you like this video, if it's helpful, if you'd give me a thumbs up, that would help the YouTube algorithm so this video gets shared. Um, also, if you like this content about learning about home loans and financing and how to um, you know, make that process easier for you if you're going through that, uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I try to put out as many videos as I can. So thanks, have a great day, and here's to your success.